Hello, welcome back. It's been a long time. I have a good reason for not recording for a while. Um, I got sick, and then I had to go to the hospital. It was a whole thing. Uh, basically, I just got two stomach viruses at the same time, and they destroyed me and got me very dehydrated, and I had to go to the hospital. I just had to get fluids, IV fluids, and, uh, but yeah, I got better, and I was just very weak after the whole thing, and I just didn't have the energy to record anything or stream, but I'm better now, so we're all right, and I'm ready to do more things and make sure that we can get the Oakland Athletics into a competitive ball club. And now we can do the draft. We've been waiting a long time to get into the draft. We got the first pick. And last time we were getting ready to do that, we had the whole international free agent signing thing where no one wanted to sign with us. And essentially the whole team is not performing. That's really where we are. Just all around... No one is really doing well. Like, that's really where we are. I bumped in my microphone there. Sorry about that. Because we were hoping to trade Ramon Laureano. Didn't really work out that way, but... We're not really performing all too well. Brendan Donovan's doing what he can, but... You know, we signed Cody Bellinger open. He would bounce back for us, and we could, you know, flip him. Not working out. Ramon Laureano, like I say, we were hoping that he would perform well enough to trade him. Not really doing too well, but, you know, Kevin Crone has 17 home runs, so that's something. And then Shea's not doing so well a catcher. when He was our um, Sean Murphy replacement, so. Now we put... Uh, who did we put? We put someone in the lineup who we were, um... It might have been Matt Duffy. I it, It's been way too long. I forget. It might have been Matt Duffy that we put in the lineup. And I think we claimed Donovan Solano off waivers. I, I'm not sure. But this is where we are. And then pitching-wise, we're just a straight-up Mess. Aside from AJ Puck. AJ Puck is just carrying this team on his back and I guess Joe Ross is, is respectable, but we still don't really have an ace. So that is where we are. We're struggling all around. And then it was Jacob Gonzalez who we were looking at. And then Let's see. So, but yeah, I think Gonzalez was our one of our top guys who we were looking at. And I'll probably draft him. He will probably be our first pick. Just because he's already got the well-rounded attributes and he's projected to be going upward OSA. Has them a little bit higher, but they also have average scouting and accuracy. We got very high accuracy on them. So let us go to the draft. And we will start the draft. First pick. Yeah, like we, we were taking a look at pitching and you weren't seeing the uh, the overall being paired up with the potential. I was kind of wanting to go pitching, but I mean, we, we really need kind of everything. So I think what we will do is go with Jacob Gonzalez here. I think that will be our play. You know, Doug doesn't have, you know, the four and a half star potential, but he's got the four star potential. So I like that. He's got the 
Man, 13 mil. I think it's worth it, though. I think it's worth it. He's wanting three mil more. It's hard signability for us, though. Do we, man, do we take the risk? I think we'll just, like, we just got to meet his demand. We'll do it. Meet his demand. And hopefully that doesn't bite us. Hopefully it'll just be like, yeah, 13 mil. That sounds good. We'll auto draft. Just spent a third of our draft budget on one player. Let's see. Aside from that, I, re I really didn't have a plan. My plan for drafting is I don't have one. This guy, we got a pretty good idea of what he brings. Teddy McGraw. That's that's one of the things I don't have down in this game. Is drafting. I've got a couple tips while streaming. Like, you just want to look for, you know, like they're starting out attributes. Doesn't have a ton of power, but it's kind of got like a Brendan Donovan profile. Kind of like the extremely hard. I can't. This guy's very eat. I can't take a reliever. I do that in MLB The Show. I take a reliever, but. Not here. Impossible. Very easy. Let's see. You take a while to develop. How about Braden Taylor? I'll take Braden Taylor. He wants 1.3 mil. Meet his demand. Extremely hard, extremely hard. Let's see. I usually go just like 10 rounds. And then just let the CPU do the other 10. It's probably not what I should be doing, but I'm just not the best at drafting. I like the curveball. Not starting out with great stuff, movement, or control. That can probably be developed. My lord. This man is an elite changeup already? Kind of tempted just because of that. From New Zealand? No, yeah, why not? What's he wanting? 750? I'll take it. Just because he has that elite changeup, I, I want him. I think there, there there's also some like seven foot two guy in this draft class. Yeah. There he is. Which is awesome. Imagine walking out to the batter's box. You're facing a seven foot two pitcher. Any pitcher would scare me, but seven foot two? Man needs to be in the WWE. How about 
then I already took a shortstop. How about gray? Uses humor to ease clubhouse tension? That's an amazing clubhouse guy. Andy, 6'7". I'm tempted. Now what? We could use a man to ease clubhouse tension. Have you seen our record? We need someone like that. We, we might need him. We might just call him up immediately. Just cause... Because, man, there's probably a ton of tension in this clubhouse. Joy's hanging out with teammates after the game. Well, that's awesome. Does what's asked of him. Well, you know, that's good. Good gap power. It's like Dylan Carlson. Who sucks in this game. Don't understand if it rarely makes waves in the clubhouse. Well, maybe you could at least ease clubhouse tension while you're in the clubhouse. And we'll draft you. And just average. Oh, Jake Brooks. Sounds like the name of a country singer. Doing fitting well in most organizations. I hope you don't like getting paid. Come on down. Cherish his privacy and can't wait to leave that. You know what? I feel that. And for that reason, you're on my team. Alright, I'll drive to batter now. Mix it up. Short King Carrington Aaron. I don't care if you're hard to sign. I need a short king on this team. Get over here. Much of what happens in his career arc will be up. I feel like that's every player. I I feel like that's every player. I I'm not going to lie to you. But you know what? Why not? First base, get over. Bro, Elijah Dukes. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. I feel like I've seen you before. Nate LaRue, was that Jason LaRue's son? That'd be funny if it was. I'll take another hitter and then I'll take a pitcher. So, hitter. Boom. And then I'll take a pitcher. And we'll auto draft. Because I'm sure that this is not the most riveting gameplay. Oh my god, John Glasscock. Absolutely. Yes. Amazing. Fantastic. Alright, auto draft. We got a. A short king, John Glasscock. Greatest draft ever. I swear to God, if my first overall pick is not signing with me, I will be upset. 
Okay, thank God. John Glasscock is signing with us. Because if he was not, we were going to have issues. Personal message. Kim, come back, Kim. You have 21 homers. You need to, you need to come back. It's an oblique strain. Just shake it off. Just rub some dirt on it. It'll be okay. Trade proposal. All right. I mean, I'm trading Joe Ross, but what am I getting from you, Angels? All right. I mean, I'm not missing much out of you, Seth. Three stop. Okay. Wait a second. Hold on. And four. Am I being deceived? Am I being bamboozled? Run amok, let a shred? I mean, he's my best pitcher, but... I will absolutely trade him. If they're giving me that. I mean, we got nothing to play for. Then they're just giving me a two-star for fun. Well, we got low scouting accuracy on him. Hold on here. Let me get a scouting report on him first. Hold on here. And Zach. Okay. This could be something. This could be something. I got to face Houston with Jacob DeGrom, but this could be something. We lost to Jacob DeGrom, as we should. All right, Braden Taylor. There we go. Nelson. Do we have any All-Stars? We probably don't, but it's nice to think that we could. Yeah, we, we don't. We're just going to have AJ Puck there just because they feel sorry for us. Hey, we at least beat Houston one game. So that's pretty cool. I'm happy about that. Drain that. They're trying to deceive us with this. But honestly, I might take the offer. It's probably expired. It's not. Okay, good. Did not sim enough. AJ Puck's hurt. No, my best pitcher. You can't do this to me. You know what? We're going to do it. We're going to trade Joe Ross. Angels probably need him, I guess. I don't know. How are the Angels doing? Yeah, they need him. We'll do one. Do an interdivision trade. It's on a one year deal. Uh, what are we going to do? Win 31 in a row and come back? No. If we do that, I'll eat my computer. There you go, Angels. Have fun. Have fun with Joe Ross. I gotta say, if I got an email about the team morale going down. There's no way it could be any lower. All right, so. Not good. Now I need a pitcher to be on our roster. So who wants to be on the Major League roster? Adrian Martinez? No, no, you do not. That is a terrible ERA. But you know what? They're probably the best option we got. Not gonna lie to you. So, have fun. Come on up. Enjoy the show. You will be our new ace. Hopefully you're rested. And you are. Nice.
you will face George Kirby. And, well, you know what? And do too bad. Offense got three hits and struck out 15 times. George Kirby destroyed us. We are owned by George Kirby and the Seattle Mariners now. And AJ Puck is in a bleak strand. He gets to join Kim with an oblique strain. Hopefully we actually know for sure he's coming back. Because we got no idea when Kim's coming back. And Seth Brown's just chill with the strain Achilles tendon. Alright, so who wants to pitch for us? Gunner, you are pitching so well that you will go to Triple A. How about that? Wait a second. Is he on our 40 man? This what he was. Where is he? Is he not? Look at the wrong thing. Oh he is. Cool, get up here. 220 year in the minor leagues. What's your stamina? 60? Absolutely. Absolutely. You know what? Miles Michaelis can be in the bullpen. He can be a middle reliever. We'll complain that he's not a starter, but you do not deserve to be a starter with that ERA. We beat Jacob DeGrom 1-0. Let's go. Look at us. Struck out 13 times. It doesn't matter. Did you know the Athletics went 103 and 59? Did not know that. Would have never guessed with this team. What a great quote by Carl Crawford. Look at the Mariners doing things. Oh my gosh, Kim's back. Brent, no. Don't do this. Don't. No, I do not need Brendan Donovan hurt. This is not what I needed. Who do I send down? I'll send down one of these first basemen. And I'll send down Garcia. You go to double A Midland. He will put the mid in Midland. Not what I do. Okay, so what we'll do can we'll play for a little Rihanna. And until that third. Easy. And play center. Ballinger will play right. There we go. Oh, here we go. All-Star Game rosters. Let's see. Who, who got a pity All-Star selection for Oakland? Oh, did they? Oh, no. Oh, no. We, oh no, we, we did not get a pity all-star selection. We're, we're, we're not even, we're, we're, oh no, 
We didn't get a pity all-star selection. No, wait. Let us in, please. I swear. I swear at least one person on this team deserves it. Brendan Donovan. Please. Well. It does say talented stars. Granted, I feel like Brendan Donovan should have gotten a pity all-star selection. Oh, no. Did we at least get a prospect in there? Oh, thank goodness. Oh, it's the guy that we... <laughs> The guy that we traded for. Doesn't even count. Oh wait, Soderstrom. Okay, good. Oh, praise be. We at least have something to be proud of, I guess. You know, there's one thing. Why is Matt Duffy getting suspended? Matt Duffy showing more fight than the Athletics have all season. We're both really competitive. I I don't think so. I don't think I I don't think that's true. Now why did Duffy get four games and why did Kramer only get two? What is this? Duffy, if you show us... What? Tell me why... He was doing so well. I mean, sure, he's not, you know, slugging the baseball, but... The on-base percentage. My shining star. No. This can't how No. Don't. I don't want to do it. Don't. No. I can't. Don't want to. That hurt me so much. <sighs> The team rat. Okay, I, I mistook that for home run challenge. Thank God. I, I thought Adalberto Mondesi won the home run derby for two seconds, and I was about to be even more afraid for my life. Well, who do we call up? Adrian Martinez, nice. He got a 238 ERA. I can't wait for that to be ruined. All right, Triple A. Who wants to play second base? Logan Davidson. 26 home runs. All right, you're like the opposite of Brendan Donovan. How about a 40 man roster addition and a call up? Does that sound fantastic? I hope so. And your switch hitter? Have fun at the top of the order. How are you angry? We have been tanking the entire season. You can't be too angry. Alright? Is it because you suck? That better be it. How is Kim doing? He has hit zero home runs since coming back. This is upset. At least Kevin has 20 homers. It's really all I can ask for out of him. He has a negative point one war. No one has a war above one on this team. This is... The saddest team I have seen. Collectively, this offense might put up a negative one. And honestly, we deserve to. The pitching staff also might collectively put up a negative war. All right. This is... 
the what? Just to to prove myself on the big stage. Big stage and Oakland Athletics, I don't think, qualify. Especially when we are 34 and 72. This is a very small stage. But if you want playing time, I guess I can give it to you. Because honestly, what else are we going to do? So, you can be a DH. Because Brent Rooker sucks. So, there you go. Have fun. Merry Christmas or something. Trade deadline coming up, and we have no one to trade. Because everyone is bad. And the one guy worth any vow, Adrian Martinez, is on steroids. This is the only explanation for this start. Mild-mannered. He's taking some mild-mannered steroids. Donovan Solano, you've gotten worse since I put you in the lineup. You're hitting 250. What happened? But yeah. We got we got no one to trade. So. And I already traded Joe Ross. So. Well, Ben Rooker went up. Oh, Donovan. Your overall potential went down. And I called Gunnar Hag ha Hogland up. A priest. Do not like that. Soderstrom went up, though. I enjoy that. I enjoy that a lot. So is Lawrence Butler. Johnny Butler. Okay. What are you doing? Can't even see. Johnny Butler. Alright. I mean, sure. One and a half stars. Nice. Okay. One and a half. Okay. 6'11 ERA, and this man's just skyrocketing. These are the things I enjoy. And Zach is now a two and a half star overall. Beautiful. Let's go, team. AJ Puck is back. Who do we send down? Probably anyone. I was... Alright, you know, at 4.35? I mean, sure, it's not the worst. There are definitely worse ERAs on this team. Like Danny Jimenez. So, triple A you go. Oh, Nick Allen's also eligible. Except Nick Allen sucks, so... That's where you get to go. You get to go to the land of mid. Oh, well, first you get to go on the 40-man roster. All right, maybe your 40-man's full. You get to be waived and designated for assignment. No. Gonna see if we can't just finish the season.
No one wanted Nick Allen. Wow, I'm shocked. Guess where you're going? Triple A. Yeah. Scott Aaron Judge was a Met in this universe. Getting two's off. Hell yeah. We have forty games left in the year. We can we can finish this out. Strained up. Why is everyone getting oblique injuries? What is going on with this team? No, you're gonna you're gonna tough it out. Besides, Shea plays catcher anyway. Night Talks put up 14 on us. What is this? I think Trout got hurt. Speaking of getting hurt. A 60 day IO for you. And then we'll call up. Let's see how Soderstrom's doing. How's Gunner doing? All right, we're fine. Is there anyone doing not awful? No? Okay. Anyone? Thank you. Appreciate it. There we go. And then middle relief and set up or something. There you go. Look at AJ Puck, best pitcher in the world. No bias at all. Out of the playoffs, you don't say. We've been out of the playoffs. Could have said that in April. Look at Adrian Martinez. Let's go. And Logan Davidson. Even though he's bitten at the Mendoza line, but he has eight home runs. Nick Allen's overall went up. All right. I mean, I'll take it. Anyone else? Robert. And will be the show legend has 22 home. Okay. All right, steroid man. Keep it quiet, though. We got roster expansion. All right, we will call up Gunner and Tyler. And give them a look. Yeah, Donovan, your stats got worse. So, sit down. It's time for Tyler. He's going to come in there and he's going to do great things. I hope so, at least. And then Gunner. I'll just be the fifth starter. Just move people up. And then all the Chuck. Honestly, I'll just go. Six man rotation. Six man rotation. And we lost to Miami. 
And we'll just go six man rotation and just not mess with that at all. And we'll just send to the end of the year. I didn't sign Brandon. That's okay. Soderstrom at three home runs in a game. He's perfect. He's already perfect. Two coming off the former athletic Sonny Gray. Look at this man go. Listen, if Soderstrom can play well, I'm good. Oh, my Lord. Well, I mean... That's... That's... That's great. One in 13. My goodness. What a season. Well, I guess we need another pitcher. Who wants to pitch for us? How about... Brian Howard, come on down. You're the next contestant of what even is this season. Facing Shohei Otani. Then under losses. Yes. They're the best. Gunner did not have a great first start. And Adrian Martinez has started playing like everyone else. Joel's pitching well, though. Look, look at him go. It's nine and two-thirds innings, but we take our we, we take our victories. We take our victories when they happen. And that's okay. Well, look at us. You may have a hundred wins, but guess what? So does another team. Donovan, I swear, if you're complaining about playing time again, I find it perplexing that I haven't received an offer to extend my contract. Well, Donovan, if you take a look at your stats, you will find that that is the reason. And if you still find it perplexing, then I will release you on the spot. Hey, remember when Tyler Soderstrom had a three home run game? Yeah, that was nice. He hasn't done anything since. All right, well, there we go. There's the season. We finish 55 and 107. And best pitcher. I mean, Adrian Martinez, kind of, sort of, maybe. I don't know. But yeah, shout out to AJ Puck. He did his thing. He went out there and tried. That's all I can ask of him. Great morale. He was like, hey, you know what? We may be losing, but I'm pitching phenomenally. Then offensively? Now Logan Davidson at 18 home runs in a short time. Kevin Crone, 34. Him, 31, and let's see how many steals he had. Let's see here, 15. Ballinger, very rough. And we had Brendan Donovan get her. And Soderstrom had a nice little start, and then he struggled. Shea got to 20 homers. 
You got to a war of one. Kim, 1.8 war. Loriano somehow had a war of one. Yeah, Kim, probably the MVP. You know, out of everyone else on this team. And then I guess AJ Puck will give him the Cy Young. And JT Ginn, you know what? He managed to pull out a decent year. Eighty-three and a third in the three thirty-five year A. We'll take that. Acevedo, three seventy-six year A. We'll take that. Sorry, in rotation though, horrendous. So I have the uh, off season next time. As the Rockies beat the Cardinals in the wild card game. And doesn't look like we got the AO wild card game. Let's see. Where are you, playoffs? There we go. Playoff tree, there you go. Colorado and San Diego advance. And then Seattle, Houston, New York, San, or Seattle and Houston are tied. And Yankees and Cleveland are tied. You know, let's just see. There we go. So, here are the playoffs. Angels versus Houston. Tampa Bay, Cleveland. And then LA, San Diego, and Atlanta, Colorado. I want to... Colorado, let's look at them. Ow. Ow. Just what? Just sheer will by the offense. That, that is incredible. Just sheer will by, they, they went 82 and 80. So, yeah, next time we'll see if Colorado can have a miracle run to a World Series title. That that will be what we're watching, then we'll do the offseason, and hopefully we can have a better 2024 season. Yeah, I appreciate you guys watching, and feels good to be back. And see you guys next time.